Take your drink. Sir, I don't want a drink. Sir, please. I just want to clear my name first. I'm a foundation staff of the bank, and I've never been found one thing. Sir, please, can I have the documents so I can clear my names? Please, sir, please. You'll get the documents, for sure. But first, I would like to ask you a few questions. Apart from the day we met in your bank when I came to deposit money, do you remember any other encounter with me? Yes, sir. I, I remember your mom's burial. A lot of people were spraying plenty money. People even came with a lot of cows. That's not what I'm talking about. Personal encounter, I mean. No, sir. I can't remember anything. Really? Fraud in the bank. Hey! Why are you screaming? Fraud! I knew it. I knew that if Fomai was always slow poison, I was pretending to be self-righteous, but then she is the devil. I knew it. Hey! Wait, wait, wait. If Foma has nothing to do with this, she wasn't even the one that was accused. But why was she arrested? Kelechi, why was your friend being arrested? Huh? It was a false accusation. It was a false accusation. Hey. What kind of false accusation? Eh? That young, tall, sexy, nice man I saw will never accuse anybody falsely. Really? Yes. She committed an offense and she's been arrested. I pray she should go to jail. Yes. A shagara in this village is too much. Always carrying her shoulder up, behaving as if she's the first person that works in the bank. Cynthia, microfinance bank at that. What is your problem with Ifoma? Why are you always bitter about her? She what is too arrogant and self-righteous. Holier than thou, but with a wicked heart. No wonder Odinake abandoned her and married pretty Adora. <laughs> and you have been her friend all along. And you're even mocking her with something that happened to her. So you're happy about it. Aww. Huh, Sai. What could I have done? I was just managing her as my friend. You know, I was thinking that she would change. But no, she goes worse by the day. And now, <laughs> Kama has cut her with that. <laughs> Kama! I, I don't agree with you. Ifoma cannot do that. Ifoma didn't do it. Why would you agree with me? Huh? When you're busy enjoying the money she stole from the bank. I won't take that from you. I will not have you say rubbish about me. Did you hear me? What's even wrong with you? Slow down, my friend. Slow down. You know, the truth is always bitter. Very bitter. <laughs> but let me tell you something. Just a piece of advice, my friend. Be careful before they come and prank off you too. Hmm? What is even wrong with this girl? Well, I don't blame you. I blame you for for mother made you a, a friend. Rubbish. The day I came to your bank to deposit money and I saw you. I kept saying that. I know this person, you know. I I couldn't I couldn't recollect, you know, where we met before, but I don't know. <laughs> I got back home, he kept on disturbing me until two days ago. I think I remembered clearly. And I started looking for you. I don't understand. Where was that? Many years ago, then I was still serving my master. I was traveling to Lagos and I don't know what happened to me. I lost my money. I, I think I was robbed or something, you know. 
these pickpockets, guys. <laughs> it took my money, my, my wallet and my phone. I was stranded. I was crying. I tried to explain to the driver and the passengers there, but nobody believed me. But a young lady paid for me. You remember. Yes, I, I remember. That was um, 10 years ago. Exactly. I was going to purchase my jam form in Lagos. Yes. I remember, I remember. The, the, the people there, nobody believed me. They, they, they thought I was a fraudster. Mm -hmm. But you volunteered to pay my transport fee. Yes. Yes. This voice. <laughs> I remember. <laughs> Small word small well, then you <laughs> were a teenager and I remember you told me you were from this village Shumudi. yeah but I don't understand Emeka Tigana is that really you? well to the glory of the almighty God it's me good to see you again I, when I came to your bank I saw you I said I knew this person kept on disturbing me. I said, I know, I know this lady. I, I just couldn't remember where I, where I met you. And then finally I recollected and here we are. I had a lot to say. Oh. Girls, you girls miss. You should have been there to see what I saw with my two eyes. Police, police came in that they are big van. If you see the way they were coming down, they cocked their gun and they were shooting. You needed to see the way they dragged Ifoma. Your Ifoma. They dragged her. You needed to see the way they kicked her. What did she do now? She is a criminal! They say she and her gang robbed bank and stole so much millions. See, they are taking us to Abuja and they say she's not coming back. She will be in jail. Everlasting to everlasting. She's not coming back. They, they, if you see the way they. Oh my, it's so disappointing, so disgraceful. You needed to be there. You, the way they were beating her, she started calling names. She was mentioning people one after the other. She was. Eh? Hey. It's so disgraceful. I can't even say it. I can't even hide my face because people know I was a friend. Oh, I was close to her. No, I disagree with you. I don't believe that Tifoma can do such a thing. Shut up! Yeah. Who told you that? Eh, that's the water of us. She is so poisoned. I told you. You needed to see the way they drag her on the floor. Like you girls were not there. You were not there to see what happened to her wife for Mao. Hey! I wish I'm there. I like seeing this kind of thing. I should have been there to see it. You see the way they, 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 they kick her. She was crying. She was even confessing that it's not only her that they are plenty. Oh, she, she begins to call them. She was calling. Ah, you needed to see something. First of all, Let me apologize to you for coming to you the way I did. With the police and, you know, it looked as if I came to arrest you. The whole bank then, uh, documents accusing you of fraud. It's all a prank. Believe me. You know what a prank is, right? Yes, it's all a prank. I came up with that so I can bring you to my house. I'm sorry. Oh my God, but really that was an expensive prank. Someone would have died or something. You're right, and I apologize. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. It's okay. <laughs> but I, I noticed something. All through, you were not rattled by the situation. I was actually, but when I saw you, I became more relaxed because I know you wouldn't hurt an innocent person. Really? Yeah. How did you know? People say you're kind and generous. Oh. <laughs> now I'm blushing. <laughs> okay, so at least we've established that I cannot hurt you. Take your drink while we talk. Thank you. So, why do you bring me here? to propose to you. I don't understand. He 
You're joking, right? You're joking, right? You're a wonderful person. A very wonderful lady. And you deserve the best. Please marry me. Yes. I will marry you. Like a drink. Oh God. Thank you. Thank you. I missed you too, girl. <laughs> what happened? I've been trying to reach you, but and your line has not been connecting. I know you've been trying to reach me, but he seized my phone. In fact, he threw away my phone. <laughs> Who seized your phone and why? He got me this, girl. An iPhone. Who, who got you an iPhone? <laughs> and he I proposed. Damn ring, baby girl. Damn ring! <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> who got you this ring? <laughs> I'm proposed so to you. Emeka Tigana. Yeah, wait. Sit, sit, let me see. Emeka Tigana. You remember the incident that took place? Those men that came to the house yesterday were not Paris men. They were actually sent by Emeka Tigana to, for them to bring me to his house. Wait, you mean those boys that came here actually took you to Emeka's house? He took me to his house. He proposed to me there. He do. <laughs> Emeka. Tigana of course. proposed to you. Yes, girl, he did. How? <laughs> Wait, if he stop laughing now. Wait, have you met this guy before? It's actually a story for another day. It's a long story. I will tell you. But for now, check this out, girl. Check it out. What All for you. Bag? Open it. Don't do it. To me. Open it, girl. Open it. Are you serious? She got me all that, and I said, let me give my friend some. Wait. What Open is the box? Open it. Uh, I want you acting up. You got all these things for me? Yes, baby. All this for me? Yes, baby. He actually took me out for shopping and got the whole word for me. And I said, let me give my girlfriend some. Oh, this is so <laughs> fine. Oh. Wait. If you got all this for me. Of course. I have three bosses inside. Don't worry. You can take everything. Take the bus. Take everything. I should take even the bus. Of boss. course. <laughs> Chai, thank you so much. Thank you. You're my good friend. Oh. <laughs> He's taking me to Lagos on Saturday to see his friends and family members. <laughs> all these things are happening so fast. My dear, I can hardly breathe, but I love the feeling. I'm happy for you, girl. <laughs> thank Congrats. You. I'm happy for you. Then again, he is coming to pay my bride price. Yes. He said he wants to do a small trad, then an international wedding. <laughs> Which one is international wedding? <laughs> My one is that one? <laughs> if you ask me, who will I ask? <laughs> you go now, you're, you're getting married. I am not happy for you. Uh, I know. My kid is still Come, 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 come let me show you the things he actually got for me. I know you like Amber, but come, please let me pack my things. I cannot keep it aside. Just no, come. I'm carrying it inside. No, drop it. Stop me. Let's go in here. No, let's go inside. Let me go and see. Nchamel, bad news. We are coming from uh, Ezemo's place, and we've confirmed that it was Ezemo that told Ono that your coronation has to be suspended uh, for now. Uh, so uh, I tried to find out why it was uh, suspended, uh, but Ezemo said that the gods have not uh, told him anything. Uh, uh, the thing is that uh, uh, I didn't, I couldn't push further. I even went there with uh, two native fowls and yes. uh, two bags of yours. Two, two bags of yours, yes. Uh, all the others went except for um, Ndoka, Ndoka. Ndoka for yes. They are the only ones that did not go with us. Uh, so um, 
uh, even the money you gave us was not enough but i mm. i we had to rally around to make sure that we got what you wanted uh, uh, that is the bad news. Uh, we tried our best because we, you know that if other than other, other than right, right, if he right. profits you, it will profit yes. both of us. Um, Ichia, Ichia Kokai. Um, Igwe, Igwe. Oh, okay, Igwe. okay. Igwe, Echibago. Uh, you, you don't need to be bothered. Eh? This is just a temporary setback. Okay? And within a very short time, very soon, everything will be fine. Yes. It has been confirmed in the spirit and in the physical. Yes. It's done. Bam! It's done. It's all good. Too busy to be a king is not a daughter. Chifaku Kalia. Gaiman. Take it easy. What is going on? How? Eh? Is it not you that told me that Ifoma was arrested? Eh? Mm -hmm. Is she not supposed to be in prison? Why are we now hearing that she's getting married to Sigana? What's happening? Is she not supposed to be in prison? How can Tigana, Tigana of all people, marry someone that stole from him? Eh? What, 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 as a, what kind of story is this? She used Juju. I hope you don't suffocate with jealousy against the former. I never told you such. What kind of nonsense is that? What is this one you're telling me now? I never told you anything like that, Cynthia. You were the one that twisted the whole story to suit your hatred for her. And even went as far as telling people that she and her and robbery gang went to the bank and stole. Hey, hey! How dare you! Isn't that what you told me that I told others? Eh? Isn't that what you told me that I have to tell others? Am I the only one that's supposed to hear it? I never told you any such! You witch! It's your father. It's your family that is a witch. Kelechi is your family that is a witch. Look at this girl! Why are you denying something that you told me? Is it because it's, it's backfired? Why are you denying it? I never knew you are this evil, Cynthia. I never told you such. What is wrong with you? Kelechi. It is your word against mine. Look at you. You want to use me and shine in this village. It will not work. Hmm. Look at this one. Brat like you. Really? <laughs> you have not seen the last of me. Then let's on, watch out. Look at this stupid guy. Is something wrong with you? Me? Get... Come, 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 get that. Oh, is that what you told me? You! Are you mad? You! You, you this is what you will see. This girl is not look normal, though. Look at, look, at, look at this idiot. You want to come and lie? Before they know to tell people that you said it because I am bold. I am telling them what I said it. Why are you denying your own? Get you, why are you denying your own? Come at me, are you? See, I will kill this girl. Why, why are you denying your own? Look at you. Look at this joint. Lele like you. You've not seen the last of me yet. You've not seen it. I swear you've not seen the last of me yet. I never knew your mother's son. I told you. I told you I'll get you. You you are you're talking when I'm talking. Are you seeing me? You you keep talking yourself. Come, I'll catch you. Look at this video. You're talking nonsense. You don't know what you said. You don't know what you said. Eh? Yes, I am Cynthia. I am bold enough to tell people that I said it. They want to tell me that you say it. Look at all this pretenders. This is what I offer. You will see. Ah, what kind of nonsense is that? You lied. You lied against me. Ah, look at this idiot. You lied. You will see. Look at you. You will see. Hello. 
Cynthia. Hello, the luckiest girl in town. Ify, my bestie. The billionaire's wife. The only girl that scattered Tigana's head. Ne, congratulations, my friend. Thank you very much. All this praise is for me. Yes, you deserve it, my friend. Oh, you don't know the news is everywhere. Eh? It's everywhere. That you are Tigana's wife to be. God's favor is upon you. And you know what, my friend? I am so happy for you. <laughs> I am so happy. <laughs> like I'm overwhelmed with joy. Thank you very much, Cynthia. Thank you. Uh, please, you know you're my friend. I want you to be very careful with the people you call your friends. Hey, you know, level has changed now. Things are stoned the other side. Envy and jealousy will be the order of the day. Bikunu. Eh? Okay, but is there any problem? You know I don't have many friends, just few. Hmm. Even with that, the few ones still be very careful. Cynthia, is there any problem? <laughs> no. <laughs> no problem, just that. <laughs> you can imagine that your friend, your so-called best friend, Kelechi, she was busy spreading the news that you committed fraud in the bank and then police came and arrested you that <laughs> you will be in prison in the next 20 years. Oh, my dear friend, you needed to see me. I was weeping, I was crying, I was like, that Ify cannot do it. Ify is my best friend. I know Ify too well. She cannot do something like that. Before someone else come and tell me, no, that is a lie, yo. That Tikana sent his escort to come and pick you to his palace as a VIP and then propose to you with a diamond ring. <laughs> I am happy for you. My friend, my friend. <laughs> wow. Kele, she said all that. Live and direct. That's why I'm telling you to be careful. <laughs> Thank you very much for your love and care. I really appreciate. <laughs> um, ne. Uh, one of these days, I am going to come to your house. And please, when Oga come, tell him more so that he will get ready for me on time. Hmm? I will. Thank you. <laughs> I trust you, my friend. I you know, um, one millionaire has a gift. It's not a bad idea. Hey, you know he has been doing it for, he has done so much for that people. I'm your best friend now. If only you know me, I'm your best friend. Huh? Cynthia will deliver your message. Thank you. <sighs> Thank you so much. And you know I love you. <laughs> Thank you. And take care of Ogao. Uh -huh. I know you will. <laughs> okay. Take care of yourself. Oh, okay, take care. Mm, bye bye. Bye, Cynthia. Take care. Iman. <sighs> 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 Did you take a lemon? A lemon? A lemon? A lemon? No. No, the end. Um, we all know why we are gathered here. Ezemo has lifted the ban on the Igwe contest for our community. That is why I summoned this meeting so that uh, we can collectively nominate, adopt, and confirm a candidate to be the Igwe of Umudim community. They won. The floor is open. make The floor is open for contributions. Um, oh no, you have spoken well. Um, there is no point in looking for a candidate because we already have one. 
we have a candidate standing by. A candidate that has given so much. A candidate that has done so much for this community. Hmm? We are talking about Chief Akokalia. Akokalia name Laura. As a matter of fact, it will be an abomination to even consider comparing Akokalia with someone else. Okay. What we should be talking about is to fix a new date. So that Akokalia will print fresh invitation cards and give to his friends. Uh, he has already wasted money on the other invitation cards and beer boards and all the things he has done. But it is so, so nothing. Oh, the leaf is Let us fix a date. Give a baby. Izuago, one name, my good brother. You have spoken well. Uh, let, for me, let us set a new date for the coronation of Akokalia as the Igwe of Umudim. Not so fast, Nero. Akukalia is not the only one qualified to be Igwe. Uh -huh. And who else, if not Akukalia? Ototongwana Mulora. Opa Tosuara Nine. Akululuno. Odogune Mile Kagu. Nga Meka Nga Maduka is more qualified. Anytime, any day. Look at you. Look at what you're talking about. That boy in America. What does he know? We are talking about the culture and tradition of our people. Yes. We are talking about Igwe, the custodian of our people. Mm -hmm. In Oku, mm -hmm. uh, in America, Ibi Igwe Abuhi Igwe Club and Eba Kirikata. Eh? Talk some sense. That boy in America has done more for our community. Then your so-called candidate Akukalia, who came back from the city to exploit us. Taking over people's land, using police and army to intimidate our people. Mm -hmm. Nameka has revived our community hospital, our community school, and he is presently building a modern town hall and community center for us. Mm -hmm. Nameka has placed 50 of our brightest students on scholarship. And he has taken additional 10 to Lagos to train them in their business. Mm -hmm. What exactly has Akalia done for us? Apart from bribing some of our gullible minded elders to cause confusion mm -hmm. and to what our collective will. Yes. We are talking about we are talking about tradition, not philanthropy. This is not a uh, shouting uh, match. We are here for serious business. Um, it will be a matter of choice. It's about decision. It is not about um, fight or shout. Please, let this not repeat. Is there anybody else who has an opinion on this matter? My fellow elders, we should all know that this is not a market women meeting, but meeting of honored people, honorable people. Let us compose and be what we are. Uh, yes, tradition and uh, uh, custom, eh? they're all good. We have been in it. I lived and I grew up still in it, but with nothing to show. But I want to let you know that this world is moving faster than we expected, of which if you don't meet up with it, you will be dropped out. Yesterday, it was analog. And today, what is it? Digital. If I may suggest, we need a very vibrant young man that can stand. 
If you call him in the night, he will come out. If it has to do with going to oversee, he will go for us. If he needs to see the president, he will go there to bring what belongs to us. Mm -hmm. And there is only one person I see that quality in. And that is Nemeka. Stop campaigning! Stop campaigning! Stop campaigning! Um, well, in the absence of um, any other contribution or opinion on this matter, I want to make my position known. For so long, we have been trying to make Akukalia the Igwe of Omudim. Uh, but it did not work. It did not work, and it still has not worked. Within the period of suspension of this process, another candidate emerged the person of Nemeka. It appears the gods have a hand in this matter. If you ask me. So, what it means is that uh, as it stands, we have two candidates contesting for this position. On one hand, Chief Gabriel Akukalia. On the other hand, Nemeka Madoka. I do not want to be partial. Neither do I want to be partisan by virtue of my position. We are in a democracy now, are we not? Yes, Majority carries the vote. On the strength of that, I want to put this matter to vote. Are we agreed on it? Let us vote. If you know that you want Chief Akokalia to become the next Igwe of Omudim, Obododike, indicate by raising up your hand. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Um, as we can see, it is um, only two of us, Ichie mm -hmm. Izo and Ichie Zerowa, mm -hmm. who have voted for Akokalea. It is noted. Now, those of us who want Nemeka Madoka to become the next Igwe of our land, Umudim Obododike, please indicate by raising up your hand. The movie train! Um, and I want to join my votes. Yes. Oh, oh. <laughs> I come the name of That means seven of us yes. against two of us. <laughs> by this vote, by this vote, it means that Nietzsche, the kingmakers of Umudi have unanimously voted and decided that Nemeka Madoka shall be the next Igwe of Umodim. And so shall it be. Isse! Isse! Umodim! Makan! Yeah! Umodim! Makan! Yeah! Umodim! Mwon! Yeah! Umodim! Zwan! Yeah! Umodim! Kachango! Yeah! Umodim! Umonu! Neonuka! Isse! Okay. 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 Okay.
Is so this is what this is all about all the schemings and machinations was geared towards depriving me of my God-given position. Now, never, Onyebo Tigana, a charlatan, a Yahoo boy, a ritualist, to become my own Igwe. All you Ichies are nothing but a bunch of hungry dogs scavenging for food. I will fight this battle all by myself and still become the Igwe. Um, <clears throat> Ako, it is not our fault. Mm. Yeah? That's that boy. He bribed them. He, he gave them big money. Also, ego. He used money to confuse them. Yeah. That's the problem. Um, but if you can uh, bring some money, even if it is half of half of what you he gave them, uh, we will try to con convince them to change their mind. It's all. You put that in again. I can't give it. Get out of my house. All of you are the same. And as for you, Tigana, whatever they call you, I will deal with you. You will not know what hit you. By the time I'm through with you, you'll be better dead. Zog Eliam. Zog Eliam. Take it easy to be a king is not enough. I really need to talk to a maker on my behalf. You know you're the only one that can talk to him. I know I messed up. Yes. But I love him so much and I can't lose him. I've realized my mistakes. Please just just tell him to just talk to me, please. Well, there's no need for that now, alright? He has moved on, so I advise you move on too. Move on? I can't move on without him. He is the love of my life. I love him so much. Please just help me talk to him. I see. The very one you love is married now. Married? Mm -hmm. He has even paid um, the bright price. So what we are waiting for is his um, coronation that is coming soon. As the equal of his community. Igwe, uh -huh. Emeka, uh -huh. Igwe. I should have been the Lolo. I thought you said you don't like uh, local things. I didn't used to, but I do now. Uh -huh. I see. So you're trying to tell me that there's nothing that you can do about it? There is nothing I will do about it. It's always good for you to know what you want. No. And go for it. There's something that can be done. I'm sure, I'm sure when Emeka sees me, when, when he sees me, he will fall in love with me again, right? I'm sure, just, just help me, please. Okay, wait for him then. Good. Duncan! They are really enjoying me. 
Hmm. Look at your house. Hmm. Hmm. Your gown is nice. Hmm. Thank you very much, my friend. Thank you. <laughs> well, we are rooting for you now. Very soon, we will join you. <laughs> of course, I wish you luck. <laughs> I've been meaning to discuss something with you. What is it? Is there a problem? No, not at all. Do you know that Cynthia is not your friend? Ever since you got married to a Mecca Tigana, she has been saying a whole lot of rubbish about you. In fact, she's just taking things out of proportion. Just like the other day that uh, police people came to your house to arrest you. Do you know this girl went about telling people in the village that you were caught with your arm robbery gang? And that was why they arrested you. I mean, she's just acting like your enemy. I really don't understand that girl. Then after when the uh, Yameka finally engaged you, she then came with another story you, that she used Juju to pin him down. Can you imagine that nonsense? Yeah, I decided not to talk oh, because I, I wouldn't want to, you know, spoil your relationship with her because I don't know when you will start it. But I, I just said I should at least try and let you know because that kind of energy is not needed. I don't understand. Kelechi, I believe you 100%. You do? Yes. I know Cynthia better than you do. She even called me to report you to me. That I did what? <laughs> she said, um, actually, she turned everything that she said around, that you said you go about telling people that I'm a froster. Ah, yeah. Cynthia. <laughs> but I know better, my friend. I know better. <laughs> you know, Cynthia has never been a good friend. Yeah. Honestly. She sees me as a rival. Honestly, I didn't want to disclose all that to you because I wanted you to sit and know the right thing and tackle yourself and know the opinions to take and all that. You're really a nice person, Ify. I know. <laughs> I don't understand. Please leave Cynthia alone. Cynthia is in the house. I enjoy myself, darling. What if? Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, Good afternoon. How are you? All right, I'll be back shortly. I want to go see the local government chairman so we can discuss fixing the major road that leads to our village. Okay. Take care of yourself, okay? You too. Don't miss me too much. I won't. <laughs> Kelechi. Yes, sir. This is for you. All this for me? Yes. My wife told me uh, a lot of good things about you. Thank you deserve you. it. Thank you, sir. God bless you. Yes. Thank you. Thank and you're a nice man, too. Thanks, honey. <laughs> Thank you. Take care of yourself. You too. <laughs> if you thank you so much, what would I have done without you? Nothing. Imagine what you came all for me. <laughs> you hmm? deserve more, girl. Thank and thank you for being a good friend. Always. Always. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> but you're looking good here. See you. <laughs> me. You. That is eating money now. Me that just take his. I know. I know. Thank you, Thank you. <laughs> you will not forget your money. Forget <laughs> what? 100k. Hmm. At least you just can spare me of my day. <laughs> day nah. Not two of us. I go spray you in a small thing. My husband said our wedding will be the wedding of the millennium. Yes, yeah, so. And the title will be Igwe Wets Ife. Oh! And even the vice president will be in attendance. Wow. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> My girl is taking. Oh, I'm my happy for you. Taking. I know, right? I know. You see, every disappointment is a blessing. I keep telling you this, my dear. You know, I didn't know that God was actually preparing a better place for me. I swear. And I'm so happy. <laughs> Do you remember when I was telling you about Odinaka? You were crying over him. I told you that God was preparing something very special for you. And now it has come to reality. I know, right? <laughs> Israel. You know what? My problem is that people come in tens and twenties just to ask for assistance. And you know I have to attend to them and all. I know. <laughs> and I know you're equal to the task. Of course. Um, God really prepared you for this. I and know. I know you can handle it. Of course. So I just can. take your time and it's not really a big deal. Thank you. I really am. You are really adding. Oh. Hey, God. Don't tell me that <laughs> for my which adding. <laughs> What a surprise this is. I thought you would call to say you're coming. Take this to them. Chief Akukalia. Onyego. Onyego. This is what one can I offer you, sir. 
Um, well, thank you. I haven't got time for such uh, frivolities now. I came to give uh, a very important message to you. First, I want you to consider it a great privilege that Akokalia Rapu be aware of And And um, having said that, I. You see, these useless elders who are pushing you to be the Igwe, they don't mean well for you. They want to destroy you. I will advise you to step down from me. Support me with your contacts, your wealth, to become the Igwe instead of challenging me. Mm. Mm. <coughs> um, Chief, I'm not challenging you. I'm only obeying a divine mandate to serve our people. So you want to go ahead? Yes, I will go ahead. Not because I want to hurt you. Far from it. The people want me. The elders want me. So I'll serve them. <laughs> Let me make it clear to you. It's only the living that can become the Igwe. Chief, are you threatening me, Chief? I'm not a gentleman. I don't play fair. I have made many people disappear. Don't be counted in that number. All right. I see. Now I understand why even the gods have rejected you as well. Same way the people rejected you. Nobody wants you. You don't have leadership qualities. You have no business being king. What you're doing now is obsolete. Old tactics. Nobody does this anymore. Can get you into trouble. Look around you. I have gadgets here that just recorded everything you said. If I send it to the police, Chief, you'll go to jail. Believe me, if you doubt it, I can play it back for you right now. I'll advise you, Chief, don't do this again. Do not try it. I'm not a child. I did not get to this level by being stupid. I'm a very smart young man and I'm very rich. Very, very rich. I'm equal to the task. It means we'll go, Chief. It's we'll go. Do not try this again. Aquado Morfuma. Don't. small boy like the gun outsmart you. How could I have fallen into such a trap? Now, I can't do anything indirectly. Otherwise, that devilish gadget will be used against me. Hello, son. Listen, Nambe. I don't have money. Look, this Igwe thing is costing me a lot of money. I mean, are you not ashamed? People send money from abroad to their parents. Here we are sending you money. You follow them again? A young man like you, 28 years? 
and you, you just ask for money as we will pluck it from one tree. I am here working for this ego thing because when I get in, I'm going to make it hereditary so that you can become the next ego. So I'm in, indirectly working for you. And here you are. Join other boys. Take a part-time job. Pay your school fees. Do things. Don't I was not for this kind of nonsense again. Give me a good if Darling, believe me, I do not like the way you just spoke to our son now. Like I how? don't like it. Like how? You should be encouraging this boy instead of making him feel hopeless, worthless, and useless. Ugo Madi, the worthless, hopeless, and useless. I should be speaking to a 28 year old boy like a motivational speaker. After spending millions of naira, spending for his first degree, he studied a four year course in six years. I should be talking to him nicely, eh? And so, and so, all fingers are not equal. That is your old dictionary. You cost all this. I wanted my son to study here so that he can also understand my business so that he can take over. You wanted him abroad because your friend's children are abroad. Unnecessary, unhealthy, unrivaled competition. Look at what it has cost us. Honey, please. Honey, I don't know what you're talking about. All I'm trying to tell you is please look for money and give to this boy for his master's program. That's all. Ugo, ma. Send him your own money. Each year go. Which money? Which money, I ask? When was the last time you gave me money in this house? Dick Heddy Banaga. But say now. Say. The only thing that matters to you right now is just your contest about this Igwe. That's all. I don't have time for your petty statements. You are just like your son. Hmm? Look at it. I'm trying to get money. I place that my land at Amateur. 10 plus of it for sale. So I can be able to undo this boy. And here you are talking no no nonsense. Just hear yourself. Negodi. Ochiara, hear yourself. Just imagine what you said. You want to sell land to match a little boy. Namumbano. Odaba. I left your father two million naira. He's not been able to take my call. So I made my call avoid. You should see me every day and start clapping. I built a house for your family. If not, who no And here you are talking nonsense. When I talk, you talk. You feel like they make No problem. No problem. Why don't you go to CNN and announce it? What you have been doing for me, your wife, and my family. Go and announce it. That's it. Oh. What have you ever done for anybody without using it against that person? I have gone to BBC already if you don't know. Mm -hmm. Yes. Go what? You should. Look, let me tell you. Mm -hmm. You should be happy I pulled your family out of poverty. You should see me and start saying Jehovah bless this man for me. Here you are talking about money. Give me some alcoholics, woman, I'll be humble. I want some alcoholics. I don't blame you. Look at a boy who is now a full grown man who should take responsibility. Can't even pass one exam. Like trail and a push Volkswagen. First degree. Now, on a member's size degree. I can't even put it like that. What is it? Chifako Kariya Chifu Anya Take it easy Do you believe I did it? Do you believe I'm a ritualist? That I'm a kidnapper? Do you? No Never if I did, I wouldn't be here. Thank you. So who do you think is behind this? Who else? If not Akokalia, or maybe some other criminals. But Akokalia and his acolytes want to pin it on you. The witness said she saw one of my boys there. How do we explain that? That is where I am confused. I tried to talk to that girl since yesterday. But she's always in Akokalia's house. 
or with Izogo and Zeroa. Hmm. Something is going on. Something fishy is going on. Definitely. Those vultures are up to something. And I will get to the root of it. I will get to the root of it. <sighs> I'll be traveling tomorrow morning. First thing tomorrow. 